Welcome to Wild Breakaway with Mike Greenlay. I'm Audra Martin. The Minnesota Wild were hoping to make it three in a row for the first time this season. Unfortunately, they were facing a Winnipeg Jets team that's playing with a lot of confidence in themselves and in front of their goaltender. And for the Minnesota Wild, they came out flat. And while they had a nice effort from Luke Cunning getting his second of the season, it just was too little, too late for the Wild. Well, and, and the Minnesota Wild needed to be ready to play. Uh, they, they were going to face a divisional opponent, opponent that they know always plays them a little bit tough and always plays them very close. A team that came in, as you mentioned, that's feeling good about their game. Connor Hellebuck is playing really well. They're defending well. They're doing all the things they need to do to win hockey games. The Wild just weren't ready to jump. And I think it's incumbent upon the entire lineup of the Minnesota Wild to be ready to play. And that's not just the top six guys. The top six guys are going to be the guys that more often than not are going to get you the win. They're going to get you to where you need to be. Depth of the lineup has to step up. These guys have to pitch in with a goal here and there with some good defending, and even your defensemen have to jump in with some offense as well. It can't always be on the same six guys because guess what? Those guys will get tired if you keep counting on them game after game after game. That's why we talk about depth in the lineup because those guys have to bring their game as well. Fortunately, tonight, the Minnesota Wild come up short for the second time this season to their neighbors to the north. Shots on net were dead even after two periods where the Wild pulled away there in the final frame. Just couldn't make it count when they needed it the most. And four straight games now, the Wild have put up goose eggs on the power play, but three for three on the penalty kill tonight. Here's what Bruce Boudreau had to say about his team's efforts tonight against the Jets. I mean, self-preparation hasn't been there for a few games right now. And, you know, I mean, we were lucky to be in the position, quite frankly, we were in in the last 10 minutes of the game. It should have been, they have two breakaways, maybe th three, and uh, it could have been three or four nothing going into the third period. So here's a look at what's next for the Wild. The six-game homestand continues Thursday as they welcome the Montreal Canadiens to town. A Montreal team that did not get off to the start that a lot of people expected. Yes, they've had a couple big wins here recently, but Carey Price, such a backbone in that team, looking like a very beatable goaltender as well. Hopefully this is an opportunity for the Minnesota Wild to again start to get things back on track. Well, you know, you think you want to catch a team when they're struggling, but uh, this is a team that's 4-7-1 on the season. But they've won three out of their last four, and they've won those games in pretty fine fashion, scoring five goals in two of them and eight goals in another one. Yes, they were shut out in between there a little bit, but this is a team that can score, and they score throughout their lineup. They don't have any player that has more than four goals on the season, so this is a lineup that is maybe using their depth a little bit more to get some victories now, and they're starting to feel good about their game. Be careful of teams like that, because when they come in, you say, these guys are 4-7-1. Mm -hmm. Guess what? They feel better than 4-7-1 when they come in, and that's why you have to be ready for them. The Minnesota Wild came out flat tonight against the Winnipeg Jets. Hopefully they will not have a repeat performance in that sense when they take on the Montreal Canadiens Thursday night here at the XL Energy Center. We look forward to seeing you in a few days. For Mike Greenlay, I'm Audra Martin. Thanks for joining us on Wild Breakaway.